let's draw a snowman family. So the first thing I'm going to do is make a hill for them to sit on. Okay, now I'm going to make three snow people. I'm going to make a big one and two little ones. So I'm going to make three circles to show where each of their heads is going to go. And that will help me make their bodies afterwards. I'm going to go up here and make one circle. Two circles. Three circles. It's okay if they're not perfectly circular. It's supposed to be made out of snow. The one in the middle is going to be the tallest and going to be the biggest and in front. So I'll start with this one. Underneath this circle, I'm going to start at the edge right here. Not right on the bottom, a little bit over. I'm going to make a bigger circle. Okay, so it's and then bigger. And then I'm going to do that one more time. Start on the bigger circle and make an even bigger circle. But it stops when it hits the snow. Do that on the other side. Okay, let's go to our little snowman. We're going to do the same thing. Underneath. Make another circle. Oh, but now we're hitting this snowman. If he wasn't there, you'd keep going. But he is there for me, so I'm going to stop. I'm going to imagine where it goes. And I'm going to finish it on the other side. And I only have a little room, so I'll finish his last snowball. Same thing for this guy. We're going to start a circle. Oh, he didn't hit my other snowman. If he hits your other snowman, remember to stop. Imagine where it goes and then finish it. And then I don't really have a lot of room for the last snowball on the bottom over here. So I'll just put a little mark and then I'll finish it on this side. Okay, each snowman needs to have a triangle for a carrot nose, so we're going to make a triangle. I'm going to put this one the other way, maybe he's looking this way. Now for the eyes, we're just going to put two black dots on either side of the carrots. Okay, and then for their mouth, we're going to make dots, but they're going to go in a line. Okay. See how I made four dots that go together in a line?
Okay, we've got all of their little mouths. Okay, let's start adding some decorations. Uh, first thing I'm going to do is give them each a little hat. So for this guy, let's give him a top hat. So to do that, we're going to make a skinny rectangle right on top of his head. Okay, then we're going to make a tall rectangle on top of that. And a stripe right here. Let's see, let's give one of these a uh, winter hat. Uh, how about this one? This guy we're going to put a curve for a winter hat. And then an upside down U. And that's a little puffball. He's got a winter hat. And let's give this guy a Santa hat. So we're going to make that shape. Kind of like a curved rectangle that goes with his head. And we're going to make an S line. And then a curve. Another puffball. Okay, these guys need some arms, and snowman's arms are made out of sticks. So we're gonna draw a stick coming out of both sides. A little wiggly because it's a stick. And we can make a few twigs come off the stick. if he goes behind the other snowman. And for this guy. Oh, his arm disappears behind the other snowman for me. Okay, I'm going to add one more decoration. I'm going to put a scarf on this guy and buttons on one of these guys. So, make a curve under his head. And I'm going to put a rectangle. some little lines coming off that rectangle and another little piece okay now on this guy I'm going to put some little dots for buttons There's our snowman family. Bye, guys.